Hello there, guys, and welcome. So I am talking to you today about alignment, and I'm sure that's a term you've heard a lot of people talk about. Um, if you have been at all searching here on this platform for spiritual guidance, for guidance on how to manifest, for guidance on how to live a, a spiritually thriving life. If you've done any research into chakras or anything like that, I am sure you have heard about being aligned. So I want to take a couple of videos and discuss what that truly means. My name is Dr. Lisa and I am a doctor of metaphysics and divinity. And I am also the founder and CEO of Heart of Inspiration of Lightworker Academy and the creator of the Practical Lightworker and Lightworker Business Accelerator. So I tell you all of that, not because I'm just trying to pat myself on the back, but because I want you to understand that as a Reiki healer, a shaman, a minister, a tarot reader, an astrologer, all these things as an energy healer, I run into this a lot. I teach people a lot and have to had to do this in my own life of becoming aligned. So what does alignment truly mean? Listen, if you've ever gone to the chiropractor or anything like that, and you were like, oh gosh, I'm out of alignment, right? Maybe your hips hurt a little bit or the back hurts a little bit, or the neck is just kind of like, eh, right? You got a little pain there. You just don't feel quite right. That's what being out of alignment is, right? But you can be that both physically and metaphysically. So just like going to the chiropractor, they do, you know, they pull on you a little bit and, then, and they have the, you know, they pound on you a little bit and all those great things and have you do some stretches and, and get yourself back into alignment. That's the same thing that we as energy healers would help you do but I'm going to talk to you a little bit about that and how you can do some of that self alignment. And the reason for getting into alignment, now we just spent the last seven days talking about your chakras. So the reason why we want to get those chakras in alignment, where they're, the energy is flowing through them nicely, where you, you're you hearing from up above, from your higher self, and you're able to bring it in and manifest it and really anchor it all the way down into your root chakra is just for that purpose, for the manifestation purpose, for living living this life in the third dimensional realm it to the best of your ability, to that ability that is of your highest good, to live the life that you deserve, live the best life that you wish to live. And you can't do that if you're out of alignment. Now, if I'm going to put it in other terms, basically being out of alignment is when you're people pleasing, when you're not believing that you can have the best life when you like if, if you're flying off the handle a lot like super angry all the time if there's a lot of sadness going on if there is I just can't seem to hear I just can't seem I've had people literally say you know at least I want to be able to feel I want to be able to connect with others I want to be able to connect with myself but I just can't seem to. Well, then that's when I would say there's some things that are out of alignment. Things just don't feel right. So just like you go to the chiropractor, and if you think about that, if you've ever been, or even if you go to the massage therapist, right? Or you go get yourself a massage so you can what feel better, right? So we can feel better. This is what we want to do with our spiritual self, with our energetic self. We want to be able to feel better. We want things to flow correctly. How can we begin to do that? Well, the first thing is we need to begin to identify what area is or areas are out of alignment. So what you're going to do when we get done with this video here is you're going to write down or just kind of pay attention to kind of go within and say, where do I kind of feel out of whack? If you're having feelings of disempowerment, write that down. If you're having a lack of creativity, like you've been trying to figure out what to do for this business, what to do for this, how to achieve this goal, how to find, you know, love, how to all the, but you just 
the creativity isn't flowing, if you're feeling very unstable and unsure, there's a lot of things going on in your life where you're just like, eh, I'm not sure, right? If the if you're cloudy up here and you just can't seem to think, if people don't seem to be understanding, understanding, um, um, aligning with how, like they're not getting your communication, if we're dealing with a broken heart, what's happening? Okay, what's happening? I want you to begin to write all those things down. Why are you going to write them down? Because in the next video, we're going to start from the bottom up, <laughs> from the root chakra up, going through signs that that chakra is out of alignment. Okay. And then we're going to address each and every one of those things. Because as we address each and every one, we're going to start from the root, from the stability first before we start up here. Because otherwise, if we start up here, it's not going to help anything, honey. Then you'll be in alignment up here. And then all these ideas will just be kind of floating around and they won't ever really, like, ever really manifest, never really become what it is meant to become. So, that's the first things first. That's what we're doing. So I want you to take some journal. You know, where's my journal? Here's my journal. Let me move this out of the way. So I want you, if you've got a little journal, I want you to write down in there. If it's like a notebook or whatever, take a piece of paper, take some post-it notes, whatever you got to do. But I want you to jot this down, write this down, and take note of every area in your being that you're not feeling right. Even if it's things like I'm having digestive issues, right? Sometimes I have trouble breathing. I'm having trouble sleeping. I want you to write those physical manifestations down too. I'm having laryngitis a lot. Or wow, my ears are getting like super infected and it's really strange. I want you to write all of it down. And then we're going to start from the bottom, from the root, from the stability, you're having issues monetarily, financially. I want you to write it all down. And we're going to start from the stability and work our way up, okay? All right. Now, we will see you again. So write it all down. I'll see you again. And I never want you to forget, give permission to your purpose to provide for your person. This is Dr. Lisa. Oh, don't forget to do all the things like like and share and follow and all that great stuff. Like, can you do that for me too? Um, whatever the platform is, that'd be great. Okay. Thanks so much. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.